guys and welcome to the JJ Show. JJ here. Today we've got another fantastic magic trick for you. We're on day four of our Learn a Magic Trick. Today we're going to be learning the card by name. A fantastic card trick. If you haven't done so already, please check out some of our other magic tricks. We've got the cups and balls, we've got the 21 card trick, and yesterday we had the cut and restored as well. I really hope you enjoy this one. It takes a little bit of practice, but here we have card by name. Okay, card by name. What we have here is a pack of cards. This is any pack of cards you can get from any toy shop or you can borrow one from your family or friends. Now, what I like to do is take the cards and just cut the cards somewhere near the middle. That is perfect. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have a look at the card you cut to and just remember it for me. There we go, there's your card just there. I'm gonna take your card and place your card in the middle of the pack. Now, I'm gonna give the cards a quick shuffle. I can't say shuffle. I know, jokes don't get any better, unfortunately. Now, what we're going to do is going to try and find your card. Now, to do this, I'm going to go through the pack like this. One at a time, trying to find your card. Now, this could be quite tricky. Um, I'll tell you what, I'm really struggling. Let's just say your card, for instance, was a three of spades. To find a three of spades is very simple. I just go T H R E E O F. S P A D E S. I get three of spades just like that. What was your card? Five of clubs. Okay, so the five of clubs. We go F I V E O F C L U P S. Five of clubs. Okay, card by name. For this one, you just require a normal pack of cards. This is completely normal. All the cards are all there. It doesn't matter if you've got the jokers in or not, it's absolutely fine. Now, what we're gonna do is very simple. We're gonna memorize the bottom card. We're gonna learn how to force a card. Remember the two of spades. The two of spades will sit on the bottom of the pack. This is gonna be the card that they pick. What you do, you ask them to cut the cards. They will cut the cards like so. Once they've cut the card, you take the bottom half with the two of spades on it and you just rest it on top of the top half of the pack. You now say to them, let's have a look at the card you cut to. I'm not going to look, I'll let you memorise it. And you show them the two of spades. Now, you take that card and you place it in the middle. They can shuffle the pack, you can shuffle the pack, it doesn't matter. You don't need to know where the card is because you already know what that card is. Now, this is the, well, I wouldn't say hard part. This bit takes a bit of practice. As you turn the cards over, you've got to now look for the two of spades. So as you go through the pack, one card at a time, looking for it bit by bit. If you get so far, just move those cards to the bottom. You might need them a little bit later. Keep looking for the two of spades, keep going through the pack. And as soon as you see it, which it should be coming up any moment now, two of spades just there. Okay, so we're going to spell out two of spades in our mind. We go T, W, O, and of. O F spades S P A D E S. Then the next card is the five of spades, which is going to be the first card that we mention. So we're going to spell out five of spades. Now we go F I V E O F S P A D E S. Five of spades. We then stop on the S. The remaining cards will go on the bottom. We now turn the pack over and are ready to begin. We say to them, right, let's just say you were to pick the five of spades. We now spell out five of spades, we go F, I, V, E, O, F, S, P, A, D, E, S. Five of spades. We get five of spades just like so. We then say to them, what was your card? And they will say, the two of spades. They will then go T, W, O, O, F, S, P, A, D, E, S. And there we have the two of spades. Well, guys, I hope you've really enjoyed that one today. Don't forget, this one takes a little bit of practice. Practice it on your grown-ups, practice it on your friends. But listen, if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button below, give us a like, and we'll see you tomorrow.